YouTube channel. Hello to all of my subscribers and everyone else. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, make sure that you do. All you have to do is hit the subscribe button. Today I'm going to show you how to take this plain white t-shirt and turn it into a t-shirt similar to the one that Harley Quinn wore in the movie. This is a illustration that I've recently done. Let's get started. You can create your own t-shirt design template or you can simply go online and find one. I cut this black foam board down to the size that I need for my t-shirt designs. I am stretching the plain white t-shirt over top of the board and now I am going to center the design template. It was two and a half inches away from both sides of the t-shirt and now I'm taping at the top so that I can make sure it stays centered. I'm using a black fabric marker to trace the design template and it says daddy's little monster. I'm now filling in the letters with the black fabric marker. I'm going to use a recycled cardboard, the plastic bag, and tape to cover the surface of the t-shirt that I don't want spray paint to get on. I'm laying the cereal box flat. I am using my hands to remove the sides of the cereal box that I don't want to keep on. I am now sandwiching the t-shirt in between both pieces of recycled cardboard and I'm using a painter's block tape to put on the edges so it can secure the cardboard in place. I'm using a pencil to draw a line where I need to cut the cardboard so that I can use a spray paint to cover the sleeve of the t-shirt. I am now using the plastic bag and I'm going to tape that around Before spray painting, I put on my gloves, my goggles, and my mask. Went outside to spray paint. Covered the surface with black trash bags. I started spray painting the back of the shirt first. Then I flipped the t-shirt over and I started to spray paint the front of the t-shirt. Let it air dry for about five minutes. Spray painting fabric makes it feel stiff, so I just took my t-shirt and I stretched it a bit so it can loosen up. I heat set it by placing it in a dryer for 10 minutes. All done! Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to Kiata Studio on YouTube. Alright, so we're here at Ripley's Believe It or Not in Baltimore.